Welcome. This is the energy vibration reading for the Capricorn Sun Moon Horizon sign for the month of October. I uh, November. <laughs> I don't know um why I am still thinking about October. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Um, thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Please remember you Capricorns that it is coming up to your birthday. There's a lot that is going. Mercury is in retrograde, so please remember that a lot is going to be happening for you, Capricorns. So, as we look at this month for you, Capricorns who wants to know what is coming up in 2020, um, you can also order your birthday reading from the beginning of December because then you're moving into your zodiac energy vibration. Um, Christmas is coming. This month of October is going to be um, really open up your eyes around you to things that is happening around you, you Capricorns. So we're calling up on the angels and guides, God and goddesses of the Capricorns to come in. Please align this reading for the Capricorns so that they know what is happening. Please remember to use the link here, there, or down there to get to your extended reading for November. They're all up, okay? For, um, you know, it's good to put on your notification button because I always upload the extended reading and you guys can pick up the extended reading before you get the free reading on YouTube. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for being here. Let's check out what is coming up in the month of December for the Capricorn. In the first week, this uh, um, month has four weeks, whatever is happening and transpiring. This month has four weeks. In the first week, you have a heart energy and um, this a uh, hair energy. It is the energy of the star. So wonderful. Healing is coming in. You're balancing out situation, whatever issues, situation you are dealing with. I'm seeing a healing coming in. This is the energy of the star. The first week, it is an air energy, and this is really wonderful. It's going to affect every one of you Capricorns. So wonderful energy. This month has four weeks, so let's move in. The second week, um, there is the energy of a judgment call that is coming up. If you have Virgo in your birth chart, go check out the Virgo readings because they have the same energy coming up in the second week. This is a water week. So we have hair and water. Whatever is happening um, in the second week, you Capricorns are going to be receiving some information. Okay. Information is coming in breakthroughs. In the third week, you have the energy of the tower. Whatever information or breakthrough, the energy of the tower comes up in the third week. The third week is when Mercury is out of retrograde. So this is good. Whatever needs to leave your life, let it leave your life. Whatever needs to leave your life, let it leave your light. Okay. So, um, um, ladies and gentlemen, whatever is coming up in the third week, let it leave your life. Okay. So obviously there is an issue that is coming up. Justice comes up in the fourth week. Whatever the issues is or situation, I'm seeing a balance. Justice is really coming up in this month for a lot of people balancing out karmas and situation. What needs to leave your life? Let it leave your life. Okay. So whatever the issue is and situation is, let it leave your life because obviously it was not meant for you. Alrighty, so you begin the month with a hair energy, you end the month with a hair energy, okay? You have water and fire in between. The energy of the tower is releasing you or a situation from you. And whatever needs to um, be let go, let it be let go. Because it is the month of healing for you guys. It's the energy of the devil this month. is the energy of the devil. So um, let's see what is coming up for the Capricorns in this month. So we have the star and information coming out. So whatever is coming out, the king of pentacles is here in the reverse. Um, whatever the issue and situation is, you're going to be finding out something about uh, and uh, Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra. Whatever the information is, um, for, uh, on for walk information is coming out um, about an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. Some of you, if you're in a relationship with an Aquarius man, 45 years and older, you're going to be receiving some information about this person. Whatever is transpiring, it could be a father. Some unexpected news is coming in. As we look at the second week, going in the third week, the energy of a 
um, a scorpion man, um, Pisces, Cancer, scorpion man um, could be released out of your life. This man is uh, uh, 45 years and older. This person could be re unexpectedly be released out of your life where it's nothing to do with debt. It's a common that this person could have been controlling your life. These two people um, could have been controlling your life. Whatever the issue and situation is, some of you Capricorns could have been dealing with a legal issue or you're dealing with um, and. Uh, uh, um, someone who is an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra, um, 45 years and older. So some of you could be dealing with an Aquarian man, 45 years and older. This could be a father figure. Some of you could be dealing with a Scorpion man, 45 years and older. That is an older man. And whatever and whoever this person is, uh, the tower is removing the Scorpion man, 45 years and older, out of your life. Uh, um, in the third week of November balance comes in whatever the issue whatever the situation is I'm seeing balance coming in um, uh, after this man is being removed out of your life balance is coming in so I'm seeing justice is going to prevail over a deceptive situation and a deceptive issue that has transpired and occur um, between you and an older scorpion man that is a um, that it could be a work situation it could be a legal situation that this person try um, to um, drag you in or issue or a situation and now they found out the truth and a balance is coming in so this man whatever he has done is come has come out and this person is once and for all is a uh, exactly removed out of your life this this scorpion man could have been someone who was trying um to ruin your reputation and the truth came out because in the fourth week that is going to be happening the wheel of fortune is here in the second week some good news good positive news is going to be coming in wheel of fortune is here in the second week this is wonderful unexpected news is going to be coming in but this is good positive news unexpected news is a definitely definitely going to be coming in because um um, they have found out uh, the truth about this man. So whoever this man is, um, it could have been an old boss or it could have been someone who have tried to deceive you in whatever way um, you are going to be receiving some fortunate news. Then we have the energy of the seven of swords in reverse and uh, eight of swords in reverse. You're seeing the truth about a Pisces, Cancer or Scorpion. The truth is going to be coming out about this person and what they have done. You are going to be finding out and seeing clearly what has happened, what has transpired, and finding out what this person has done. So a lot of you are dealing with an older Pisces Cancer or Scorpion man. It is coming up for some of you as a scorpion. Um, or um, It doesn't have to be, but it's coming up as a scorpion. Now, whoever this person is and whatever they have done is going to be, you're going to be finding out what they have done and the truth about what they have done. I'm seeing here the Queen of... Uh, the king of swords coming up i'm seeing this energy of the king of swords coming up you're going to be having some luck whatever legal issues you have some luck is going to be coming in because it's as if you have um open up and say exactly what has transpired so you're dealing with a lot of air sign people and the young air sign people are um being found out what they have done so you're going to be finding out that a young air sign person at work with all the pisces cancer and scorpion man and their world is about to tumble because you're going to be finding out what they have done and the injustice that they have bring and the truth is coming out and you're going to be successful the truth is coming out and you're definitely going to be successful the energy of uh, the truth coming out and you're definitely going to be successful over what they have done okay because it's as if the truth came out and you're going to be successful with a legal issue and that is what i said before and you can see this that whatever legal issue whatever that you were dealing with with an um aries Leo or sagittarius the truth is going to be coming out and you're going to be successful so here again um we're seeing that you capricorns are still working through some um some situation it is mercury 
it is the time of mercury so um it is coming up but whatever has transpired the truth is going to come out the wheel of fortune is bringing the truth to you about an issue that um was going on without you knowing it the star and um you have a strong foundation capricorns you have a strong foundation is it with a house situation is it that you're dealing with a house situation or at work with an young um, Aries Leo Sagittarius you have a strong uh, foundation you're going to be receiving a message about that you have definitely a strong foundation so if you are dealing with an Aquarius a Gemini or Libra with a man or woman you have a strong foundation against this person and you're going to be receiving news in the second week of November in the third in the second week going in the third week your enemies is going to finally be removed away from you so some of you had a lot of enemies and you're going to be finding out who your enemies are and they're going to be removed away from you because um, the tower moment comes up some of you it's going to happen the end of the second week some of you is going to happen the beginning of the third week that whoever these people people were and your enemies were you have a strong foundation and they are going to be removed out of your life whatever sadness and injustice whatever um that has transpired the energy of the tower is moving this and justice is going to prevail okay so there has been some issues and situation where people outside influence have created for you and this balance is going to be coming in and finally your enemies and the 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 the, the difficult that you have been through is finally going to be removed out of your life and this is good now um the um nine of ones you're protecting yourself from a young aquarian gemini or libra and a pisces cancer or a scorpio 45 years and old you're really protecting yourself from these people and these situation they were deceiving they were deceptive they were not honest um, you are standing your ground and protecting yourself from a young Aquarian Gemini or Libra and a Pisces Cancer Scorpion man these people have been playing against you and you are going to be finding this out some of you are balancing out of situation um, and you're trying to work out the situation um, between um, work out the situation if you're in a relationship with a Pisces cancer scorpion you're trying to balance out something trying to figure out something some of you are going to be collaborating with this person and as you collaborate with this old person it could be someone of your age group so you um, ladies 45 years and older is going to be collaborating and trying to balance out a friendship or a work um, connection you're going to be collaborating working out a work connection with a um, Pisces cancer or a scorpion man it is more coming up as uh, um, uh, uh, this person could you could be in a relationship with this person there was some conflicts the truth is coming out about this conflicts whatever is happening the truth is coming out about this conflicts whatever the conflicts is the truth is definitely coming out about this conflict so whatever that was transpiring it is um, um some issues that is coming from past life that you have been working out some karmatic issues and these issues is coming from past life so you're working out these issues and I'm seeing you being very successful especially you old people are going to be very successful coming out of uh, some deceptive situation that has transpired you're going to be finding out uh, the third week who were uh, second week third week uh, um, for some of you or in this month who were your enemies okay you're going to be definitely finding out who were your enemies whatever that was happening and transpiring you're going to be finding out exactly who were your enemies because now you're going to be seeing things happening and this is going to be good okay so I'm seeing conflicts coming up at the work floor for some of you Capricorns there's conflicts and uh, some of you could be having conflicts with an Aquarian Gemini or Libra because information comes out and conflicts is coming up but you have a strong 
foundation you Capricorn I'm seeing luck coming out you're gonna be lucky um, coming out of a situation releasing from um, your enemies luck is coming out where you are going to be standing strong over your enemies and removing your enemies and luck is coming in for the people who are going to be networking with all the Pisces and, 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 and Scorpion um, luck is coming out with your project if you're going to be networking with this person okay then I'm seeing long-term stability justice prevail you're going to be having some long-term stability justice prevail you're going to be having some long-term stability because you have the conflicts is now over and they saw exactly what has transpired they're moving um, your enemies out of your way um, because um, an investigation or um, an injustice situation is now in balance and that balance is going to give you long-term stability so some of you had some regrets regrets over issues and situation and now long-term stability comes in there is the energy that some of you are protecting yourself from a corporation um whatever is transpiring i'm seeing you protecting yourself from a corporation so i think that some of you if you and collaborate with other people or why you're protecting yourself from a corporation it's a company i'm seeing multiple opportunities in government institutes and organization is going to be open multiple opportunities people are going to be wanting to work with you and networking with you to resolve issues and situation they i'm seeing um people could be coming in from uh, far and near wants you to collaborate with them and work with them and this is going to be good I'm seeing multiple opportunities especially in work is going to be coming up I'm yes uh, definitely definitely multiple opportunities in work is going to be coming up I'm seeing some conflicts on the work floor a lot of conflicts is on the work floor conflicts at home uh, I'm seeing conflicts at home, but you're seeing the truth. Conflicts over a house, but you're seeing the truth. Um, conflicts at home, conflicts with a house, but you are definitely seeing the truth. And I'm seeing the end is coming in a transition because you're going to be very successful over a situation. So if you are dealing with an issue with an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra, um, a legal issue is going to be a successful but I'm seeing an end that is um, coming in, a transition. Um, a fast end is coming in, and I want to know what this is. Because a lot of things is coming to light. A lot of information is coming out. A lot of information is coming out. If you're looking for a job, multiple opportunities, and do that at the um, after the 20th, okay? Because don't sign any contract between now and the 20th, okay? So um all right so the angels have give secrets um about an aquarius gemini or libra um i'm seeing justice coming up against a young aries leo or a sagittarius so the end is coming into some secrets and some deceptive move that has to do with i'm seeing justice coming up against a young Aries Leo or Sagittarius okay whatever the secrets was whatever they were doing whatever that is kept this is the energy of you being successful because the end is coming in okay um, and the end has to do with you're being successful over a young Aries Leo or Sagittarius who has done some Thing. the truth is coming out okay the truth is coming out so this is absolutely wonderful it could be that some of you who were dealing with an issue with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra um, this is going to be coming out um, some of you a secrets between a mother and a son um, and the mother is an Aries the or Sagittarius could be coming out the son is um, um, or um, the young person because if you're looking um, this is a woman that is a Gemini um, an Aries Leo or Gemini and this person is and uh, um, yeah Aries Leo or Gemini because it, it is secret something that these two was uh, collaborating on this is also a legal issue that they're going to be seeing 
that and young Aries Leo or Sagittarius person because it doesn't show up who they are so it's going to affect a lot of you but it could be a Leo for some of you and it could be an Aries for some of you and it could be a Leo for some of you and it could be a Sagittarius so all three um you Capricorns are going to be dealing with them because their lies and deception is coming up the secret the lies and deception of what has happened and what has transpired wow what a month capricorn remember to go and check out the extended reading using the link below whatever the conflict was i'm seeing you having some luck luck over your enemies and people that try to work against you long-term stability is going to be coming up change your focus um elin is coming in number five change your focus and elin is, is coming in number five change your focus whatever that is happening whatever that is transpiring change your focus you know think positive and as you think positive you're bringing in positive alignment for energy is a, a month with a green energy green is about healing but it's about financial stability i am not seeing any money coming up but i'm seeing a um, balance is coming in as, as if whatever deceptiveness that was going on balance is coming in respect comes up and I that and it says I can manifest love and respect when I love and respect myself I can manifest love and respect when I love and respect myself so it's about change your focus and learn to manifest love and respect for yourself because as you change your focus and manifest love and respect for yourself you will learn to love and respect yourself and manifest these things in your life this is so wonderful ladies and gentlemen um, it is really you're working true because Mercury's in retrograde. You just finished fighting with the, the the dragon. This is all coming up. Whoever that was out there dealing with a young Aries Leo or Sagittarius, you're going to be taking them down because the truth is going to be coming out. Their secret is coming to an end. There's multiple opportunities for work that is going to be coming in for you guys. Sign no contract until the end of the month after the twentieth. Um, you're going to be successful over a legal issue. Energy of the sun comes out. You're definitely going to be successful over a legal issue. Change your perspective and um, respect. Learn to respect yourself and manifest respect and love for yourself. Namaste. Yeah.